Hi everyone, today I'm, did you sniff? No, no. <laughs> I'm not sniff. <laughs> because you've been sniffing. Okay. <laughs> oh, let's start it again. Okay, take four. Hi everyone, today I'm sat here with my husband. Why are you laughing again? I'm sat here with... Hi everyone, today I'm here with my husband, weird enough to say that, um, and we got married just over a month ago, 20th of May. That's right. Um, so I thought that before we put up the actual like official wedding video, which will come up, it'll be on my channel next week, I thought we could do something like this, which is just kind of like a chatty video where we chat about the day, things that we loved, things that didn't quite go according to plan. And then also we're both a bit sniffly and sick, so expect random sniffs from this one and coughing from me and she was sick weird first. voice sounds. Trying to kind of chat through things and I hope you guys enjoy this very rambly, chatty video, video of the day. So I got my suit from True Is Man. Uh, we actually went suit hunting. And I would say hunting's correct. Lachelle wanted me to get a maroon suit. Um, maroon would have been so cool though. It would have, but... Everyone agreed. <laughs> yeah, but we couldn't find one. Um, that's the reason why we got the olive green suit. It was beautiful. It was not very, very nice. And you wanted to do what? Black? Blue, navy blue. It also would look good. But anyways, we settled on olive green um, and it was pretty cool. My tie I got from Woolworths, it was Your shirt maroon. Your well. uh, shirt was from Woolworths. Every accessory was Woolworths basically. Belt from Woolworths. Shoes. Shoes from Woolworths. Purchased all of that uh, the day before. The day before our wedding. Don't ever do that. I, I, just, I just left it really late. My dress I bought at Bride & Co on sale. It was a big surprise to me that I even went there or that I found anything that I wanted there because all I wanted was something that was chilled and flowy and kind of fitted the surroundings that I could dance in that was just like easy going not stiff or yeah I just wanted something chilled princess dress um, not a princess dress definitely not a princess dress um nothing poofy no heart shaped anything no boob tubes and then in the end I ended up buying a boob tube dress but I basically just bought it I describe it as a framework dress because yeah. I basically just bought it for the bottom of the dress and then we bought lace from a fabric store and my friend Laura from a lace shop. <laughs> um, my friend Laura was a wedding dress designer in Jakarta when she lived there. So then she ended up doing the lace top it for me. So it actually changed the dress completely. Yeah. And it was just so beautiful. And then my shoes I got from Steve Madden. And then for the day on Friday, we stayed at a place. Just outside of Manus. Um It was really, really nice, a uh, big house with two separate houses on the same property. So it was like the main house and then a cottage. Um, it had a massive garden, uh, fire pool, fireplace, fire pool. Fire pool, not no, Jacob Zuma. Didn't have a <laughs> um, yeah, it was really, really nice. So we basically got a really big house because we wanted our bridal party or our nice. wedding party to stay with us because we wanted to have a wedding weekend, which is what we did. Yeah. So because we got married in Caledon, it's like an hour and a half drive from Cape Town. So we kind of wanted our friends and family to come through, Stay maybe on the Friday or the Saturday, have like a chilled Friday evening, yeah. stay for the wedding, come for breakfast on Sunday. So we ended up doing that. We wanted our wedding party to be with us on Friday. So yeah. we had everyone at the house, uh, we chilled, we bride, we just like had a good luck. And we only went to bed at like 12, which was yeah. really nice actually. It's just nice to kind of spend time. Um, we had a fine place. Yeah. Yeah, that was literally the best thing ever. Yes. Saturday morning, we kind of just had a chilled start to the day. Had we had mimosas, together. everyone chilled, we had breakfast. There was a point in the morning where I was just really, really stressed and I was overwhelmed. And I had a little cry at my sister and I was just like, it's just not going the way I want it to go. And I'm stressed and we're going to be late. And really cool, she, she just got all my bridesmaids together and they all just prayed for me and it was just really nice. So it was like, the, I think it's probably one of my favorite parts of the day it's not the favorite part but it's like one of the moments that i'll literally always remember because it just switched the day from being like because it was a little bit stressful at one point and then it just switched just like that to being like light and um, what i wanted it to be like just feeling calm and excited and just like realizing that i'm going to marry my best friend so that's like all that matters it's not like whether my hair or my makeup is perfect i was a little bit late 
But I think that was worth it because what happened with the music? So um, I actually... I didn't know any of this. <laughs> Luckily, I'm um, me being the stressed person. Warrior. You're a warrior. I'm Not a, like I'm someone a warrior. with a sword. I'm like a warrior. Warrior. <laughs> um, so I checked with the DJ and he didn't have the right song for the walking down the aisle. So luckily oh we were God. able to put it onto a flash disc. And then as soon as the shot got out the car, <laughs> we sent someone to get the flash disc and put it on. Like and literally my sister out. and I, it was a so win. one of my bridesmaids, someone Candace. brought the flash drive with the song. Like, yeah. <laughs> Such yeah. a win. I walked down the aisle to A Life That's Good from Nashville and Lennon and Maisie. Well, Lennon and Maisie sing it but it's from Nashville, the series. I'll link it down below so that you guys can listen to it and get, get kind of an idea of the vibe that we had. It was yeah. beautiful, I love that song. Every time I hear it, I wanna cry. How did you feel beforehand? I was a little bit nervous in terms of like making sure that all the little things were done. So yeah, I, I think from when the ceremony started, it was really surreal. It was beautiful. And then, so my girls walked down the aisle, my bridesmaids, they all wore different colors. You'll see in the yeah. the, the wedding video coming next week. Um, and I think I may put some pictures yeah. in a blog post, which I'll link down below so that you can see kind of like a rundown of our wedding as well, if you want to see it in pictures. So yeah, they started walking down the aisle and then the last person before me was my sister because she's my maid, she was my maid of honor. And then this one, I when started you started hailing. <laughs> I started to cry as soon as I saw the shell through the trees. So I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was beside myself. I couldn't control it. He kept telling me like ages before the wedding that he was gonna cry and I was like, well now I expect you to, so you better flip and cry. So I cried and Lashal laughed. I did cry a little, I did. I even, because I walked in and then this one was crying and I was crying on the inside. Like the tears were welling. She was they laughing. They the laugh, drop down everyone could my hear face. the laugh. <laughs> I just, like I said, even when I was walking, I said, don't make me cry. <laughs> um, so it was really beautiful. My mom walked me down the aisle mm. and then we did worship, which was really yeah. cool. Like that was something that we really wanted to do for the wedding. Yeah, it was really cool. We got our, our bridal party to part of the, be part of the worship. Like they um, sang, like my sister, Laura, really cool. uh, and David, Kristan. So our people were part of really the, cool. the worship, which was really cool. We chose three songs that we really love. Mm. And yeah, it was such a magical part of the day. Like it was just a space where it wasn't about us and it wasn't yeah. about what the wedding was about. It wasn't about anything other than than just singing and yeah, praising. Yeah, and just, really just cool. like, a, like a tip. We were quite stressed in deciding what songs to choose. Yeah. So like when it comes to your wedding day, choose songs that you like, yeah. that, that you want. Um, and don't really worry about anybody else. I think once we decided that, it was a lot it easier. Felt, yeah, it felt right. We wrote our own vow. That was, I think, one of like my best moments of the day. It was just like <laughs> laughing at our vows, laughing at what we'd said to one another, the special moments in it as well. Like, yeah. It was just like a good mix of us. Like there was just... Like, it was serious, yeah. but fun. I'm gonna say... Um, Pretentious. Yeah. <laughs> there was no pretense in our wedding. Yeah. It was just like really chill. Like I think our wedding just encapsulated like who we are. Yeah perfectly um our friend hans who's also our, our pastor but he's just like a really good friend as well like he was our Come officiator <laughs> okay at the rehearsal arnold. he kept calling sean you ski sean, sean arnold, arnold aldrich. aldrich and my second name is ronald so, so literally we were like <laughs> literally during the wedding with charles laughing <laughs> Just because he finally got it right, I was like, I'm amazed. He also said, please take your shit. <laughs> please take the shit in your hand. <laughs> that was the best thing ever. But, but, oh my gosh. you know what, in the end, he actually said the right thing. It was so, amazing. Like, so it was really cool. We, we burst out laughing, even though he did say the right thing, which was quite funny. It was just cool because that's what we wanted from it. Because yeah. Hans is like, he's just young and normal young. and like, and he's just like, he's just got this normal personality, like he doesn't look yeah. like a pastor. Yeah. Like he's just fun, you know? And also, he just spoke about some relevant stuff, which is really, really cool. Yeah. What song did we walk out with? 
Ooh. Was it a Lady uh, Antebellum? Not Lady Antebellum. Uh, Florence and the Machine. Florence and the Machine song Ooh. that was kind of like vibing. The, the dog days are over. Yeah. Uh, dog days. Dog is days. Dog dog. Is this dog or dog? I don't, I don't know. It, it was the Florence and the Machine song, yeah, but that's the name. <laughs> It was fun. Um, it was really, really cool. For oh, conflicting, we did something yes. different. What we did is we got a little skewers and... Basically, we just made a flag. Yeah. Describing it weird, we've got skewers. <laughs> so we stab people. It. <laughs> okay, metal flags uh, like with all different... <laughs> Sorry. Can you let okay, me explain, go, please? Go. Okay, so we made little flags, right, with sayings that we like. So, there was... Mooi. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Gevaarlijk. That's really good. Uh, Lekker. <laughs> she went. No. Yay. What was the other one? What is it? It's okay to say, isn't it? Is it rude? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. I don't know that. I think it was different and I'm excited to see the video fun. and like what it looks like. And then people got to use them in their pictures as well. Yeah. We got married at Devote which is foresty, so we got married under the trees in the forest. It was awesome. And then the reception is in a greenhouse, yeah. which is so beautiful. It's just, everything about that place makes me so happy. The, the venue costs included tables and chairs and cutlery. So when you when you think of it like that, like it, it really it's does totally make worth sense. It. There's less logistics in it for you to have to handle, for us to have to handle. I don't want to go find, like phoning, like supplies and like chairs and option. tables and it's, it's just too expensive and too annoying. Yeah. I don't have time for that. Yeah, we, we, we ended up settling with Devote. Not settling. The, well, it wasn't, not it wasn't settling, settled. but like choosing Devote because, because of the of fact that, that yeah. like everything was easily accessible. So we actually did like a really quick family photographs. Like we didn't yeah. actually have photographs with our friends. That was more like we kind of said yeah. that be like a selfie thing or whatever. It wasn't like the biggest deal to us. We kind of wanted to just embrace the day with people and just enjoy it and didn't want people to sit for three hours while we took photos so we that's my worst at a wedding it's, it's not like we don't have, we do have photos but we probably don't have as much photos as other people um because we both decided to have fun with our guests and to actually be in the moment yeah just um, experience I, the day yeah i think it was very important for us just to be in the moment i mean mm. like yeah, we, we even stayed like literally right till the end. We were. We were the ones cleaning up the thing. pack up at, at the end. And just, I wouldn't just have done it any other way. Like, that's yeah. who we are. It probably took about 30 minutes, 25 minutes to do our photos. But that's also because we got married in winter and we got married, like, our wedding started at 3 30, yeah. which meant that we only had. Up until 10 to 6. Like, literally 10 <laughs> to 6 was our time. We set. Yeah. Like, we knew what time the sun was going to set. We're not like the most camera ready people. Yeah. Like we don't know how to pose in front of the camera. Like it's just awkward. We found that out with our engagement shoot that we we're yeah. awkward in front of the camera. That's right. Um, together. Yeah, together. Even by ourselves, you're bloody awkward in front of the camera. So am I. Really? Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is so annoying. We missed our pre-drinks. Not pre-drinks, pre starters. Like our starters and our so we, for starters table. we did like a oh. <laughs> a cheese table this looks amazing like and I'm, I'm a cheese person like I like cheese like, we I literally cheese and saw bread. photos like, like, of the cheese <sighs> table I can't wait for someone else to have their wedding there so that I can have it again by the way if you are getting married get some food because yeah. we literally we didn't eat I, I, I didn't eat did from we have, breakfast we had breakfast we had breakfast we didn't have food Lunch, till supper till supper yeah I mean hindsight <laughs> <laughs> we came back and our entrance song was Turned out for what? Turned out for what? It was really I just cool. almost turned out for what? And it was really cool. Like, it's just kind of us is the best way to describe it, hey? We had a really cool DJ, it's our That's friend, really cool. and he was legit, like... DJ D-Main. DJ D-Main. <laughs> it was just the coolest thing. Like, he played a whole lot of songs that we really liked. Yeah. We gave him some songs that we really wanted. Like, I sent a list of, like, old school R&B vibes that I really, really liked. Like, 90s stuff. We had a good mix. Like, there's some stuff That's for your cool, parents. Yeah. That's what my mom would like. It's um, good to get the those old numbers out. Because the people were dancing. Yeah, but even the young cool. people. Yeah, everyone was on the dance floor. Yeah. We are skipping bits. Dinner. We had burgers for our for our dinner. Yes. It was the best thing. So we had a choice between uh, chicken, beef, or vegetarian. And they had like brie Sweet. and bacon and. Fig? No. Yeah, it was like brie, bacon. 
fig and something. I'm forgetting Sweet something, but it was so fries. yummy. Really nice. Everyone just said how great it was to just yeah. have like food that they really enjoy. It's comfort food. Yeah, like that's what we wanted. We ran our wedding to be like going to your parents for dinner on a Sunday yeah. night or a Sunday afternoon. It's just kind of like chilled and comfortable and everyone's happy and yeah. you actually walk away full. You're not like, oh dear God, we need to stop McDonald's on the way home. <laughs> we danced a lot. The whole like, time. The entire, like for hours, I the both of us stop. did not leave the dance floor at all ever, except to go to the toilets. We didn't do anything traditional, we didn't have a wedding cake. Yeah. Like we definitely didn't go traditional with the wedding. We did it's our really first fun. dance and then halfway through the first dance, they popped them. They pulled those like streamer things and it was just really cool. <laughs> and then cool. it went to like a fun song and we yeah. just kind of like, like enjoyed that, which was really, really cool. Oh, and we also had um, smoke grenades for our photo photos. Shoot. It was yeah. so cool. We kind of went with darker colors like deep maroon, black candles. Your lipsticks. My girls wore like very, very deep maroon lips. Um, the dresses were very wintry shades like a dark green, mm. a maroon, black. Um, and I just really enjoy that kind of vibe specifically because it's winter yeah. and I wasn't up for a very pink and white wedding like I'm totally sure that people are having that but it just doesn't seem like our personalities to have yeah. like a very light airy vibe I enjoyed it a lot I loved our wedding yeah, day fun. yeah we left at opposite 11 so did we yeah everyone was out like even the cleaning yeah oh wow I didn't know that favorite part of the day marrying you ha you're trying to get brownie points um my favorite part of the day I think was our, I think it was our vows and, our, and the worship. So the worship and the vows was probably my favorite part of the day. Overall, it was a beautiful day. We, on Sunday, we ended up having, like we invited everyone, like our close friends and staff to come for breakfast at the mm -hmm. house. And it was just really cool. We had like bacon and eggs and like sweet breakfast and fruit and Everything. it was just really, really so cool. It was just like a, a nice end to the wedding weekend yeah. yeah overall we had a great day yeah. if you guys have any questions we can do a q a if you'd like so if you have any more questions that you'd like us to answer then please leave them in the comments and also on instagram on twitter leave the comments i mean questions anywhere and we can answer those in another video if there are enough questions and yeah that's thanks. it thanks and we'll see you guys in the next video i will see you in the next video he won't be here Okay. Maybe I will be. Maybe <laughs> you won't. Why not? <laughs> okay, bye. Hope you enjoy the wedding video. Okay, bye. <laughs>